Hey everybody, this is Brett, and today I, somebody that has not had a lot of relationships, I'm going to tell you what I think makes the best relationship. <laughs> That's right, <laughs> me. <laughs> and it's because I've thought about this a lot and I have a very analytical brain, and so me, um, prelude this with a little bit of a story from a video that I watched recently in regards to sugar daddies and sugar babies. Okay, so this was like on ABC or something, a mainstream program, right? And um, so there's this website, and for those of you that are rich, and I doubt there are very many of you that are rich that watch me, um, you can find this website, and if you're an older, rich guy, you can basically pay to have some young college girl as your girlfriend. <laughs> That's right. You can go on there, and for a fee, you can be part of their website, and then they'll hook you up with some hot 25-year-old college girl, and she'll come over and date you. I mean, you're 60, you're 70, you're 90 even. <laughs> you got some cash? She'll come over and she'll be your girl. She'll go out with you. She might even cook dinner for you. She'll fuck you. The whole deal. The whole deal. And all you have to do is slip her 500 here, 500 there, and da 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 da. So then they asked this guy that had been married three times if he thought that this was like having his own hooker this and that and he said no it's an exchange he said this is no different than than the wives that i had before i was paying at least that much for them <laughs> all the same stuff the clothes the dinner this and that we come home we have sex da 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 da, -da. the only difference with this is that we don't have a piece of paper, a commitment. It's not called. It's still like a marriage. It's the same freaking thing. It's just a difference in age, and there's no commitment, you know. And so if we break up, there is no divorce, etc., etc. Okay, so that's, this gets my mind thinking about, like, for me, that all doesn't sound very fulfilling. It sounds like a business trade, more of like to me. <laughs> and the emotional aspects of it have got to be very confusing and distraught. And like, okay, so now let's step back and talk about what a better relationship can be. So what you want is the opposite of that. Okay, so where both partners are contributing equally in a, in a lot of regards. Like, they're very, very, very equal. In the past, you've had the man buying this for the woman. Like, I, my friend Derek was telling me a few minutes ago, after he just broke up with somebody again, how they went out together 15 or 20 times to dinner in the last several months that they've been going together. And except for once, he bought. He paid for it all. Okay, so that's no good, okay? With a, with a balanced relationship, what you want is both partners contributing financially equally. Okay? Both partners contributing mentally equally. Okay, this is what qi means in Chinese. Balance. Okay? So you want to get everything. You want to meet somebody that's at your level in as many things as you can possibly get so that you're like more like friends, you know? You're like friends. You really love this person because they rock. They come through for you in all regards. Maybe she opens the door for you because you got your hands full, or just because you opened it for her, or blah, blah, blah. You get what I'm talking about here. Equality. Isn't that what you girls want? That's what I want. And when I see my girl walking down the road, I want her to be walking like this. See how flat my heel is to the floor? 
There's no fucking high heels on there. That's asinine. All of that. See, I want her face to look like this. When she wipes it off, there's nothing on there. It's just a normal face. I want a real freaking human being. Not a synthetic. <laughs> that contributes. Now you see the predicament that I have in regards to finding a mate. I want a real freaking human being. So I want to thank you for joining me.